Welcome back. It's the last of the social links that we missed. It's Mitsuru. So let us begin. Makoto, what a coincidence. Are you on your way home? If you're not busy, would you like to do something? Mitsuru seems to want to walk home together. L that persona, I've got that one. Um, would you like to spend time with her after school? Yeah. Okay then, let's go. It's rare that I have any free time. Mitsuru is smiling. Port Island Station Movie Theater. You watched a movie with Mitsuru. Well, I never imagined the popcorn you eat while viewing a movie could taste so good. Before I knew it, I'd eaten your half too. I apologize. Chuckle. Watching movies on your own whim is so relaxing. You can have bored written all over your face without having to consider the feeling of others. Alright. Jeez. Was it boring? Oh no, I was speaking hypothetically. I enjoyed it. Sure you did. Mitsuru is smiling. I don't think I would normally have this type of conversation. You are the type of girl who wouldn't feel uncomfortable watching a movie by herself, are you? You may be more suited to ride a motorcycle than me. Motorcycle? Yes, I believe you've seen it before. I used to use it when I provided support for the team. I was wondering where that had gone. However, I didn't purchase it solely for that purpose. With a motorcycle, I can go where I want, when I want, all by myself. It's my modest attempt at rebelling against my restricted life. I had planned to get rid of it after it was damaged, but I decided to have it repaired instead. It may be a bit of an exaggeration to say I cherish it, but I do enjoy riding it when I have the time to. Mitsuru seems happy. Can I ride with you someday, pretty please? Me too. What? Alright, with you anywhere would be fun. Mitsuru seems very happy. Thank you. I feel much better. Mitsuru has expressed her gratitude to you. Your relationship has grown. Rank 5. Level 5, Empress. If you don't have any objections, I'd like to stay here with you for a little while longer. He decides to return to the dorm with Mitsuru, and we're off to rank 6. Gekken High School, Library. You accompanied Mitsuru to the library to help her with her research. All the dots. Mitsuru is looking at the bookshelf. Looking for something? No, I'm not. Thank you, though. Mitsuru seems to be pondering something. Looking through the literature section made me realize something. There are a lot fewer books about marriage and family life than there are romance novels. Do you think that means the most exciting time in one's life is before marriage? Is marriage worth that sacrifice? Mitsuru seems melancholy. She has a point though. Well, to be frank, the group is in turmoil over the inheritance issue. To be honest, I'm having difficulty understanding the expectations of the other members. But I'm the daughter of the head of the group. I'm expected to lead the company. Even if that requires me to sacrifice something to do it. My fiancé has been chosen for me. He's the new president of one of our affiliates, and he's much older than me. And if I agree to the marriage, the future of the company will be secured. He's planning to announce the partnership and our engagement at the same time. Doing so will give the appearance that the company is stabilizing. It's the best solution for everyone involved. But it's not the best solution for you, is it? It's all true. It's... Oh, real. It has been decided for a long time, but it's gonna take place sooner than originally planned. Personally, I'm fine with it. No, you shouldn't be. Contrary to her words, Mitsuru looks glum. I like that word, glum. My parents chose the same path. So I won't run away from my destiny. You should reconsider. If I reconsider and decline the engagement, then what will I do? Leave everything behind and go on a journey of self-discovery? Yeah. All the dots. Whenever I run, the road will lead to regret. Wherever. 
All the dots. Mitsuru forced a smile. Mitsuru has confided something in you with something important to, to her. Alright. Rank 6. Level 6. Empress. Mikado. Why was I born a woman? Alright, jeez. I have put forth many times more effort than others so that no one could look down on me because of my sex. And yet, what has that brought me? In the end, I cannot escape from the fact I am a woman. Marriage to a near complete stranger, having my name and group stripped from me, expected to conceive an heir. Through marriage, the Kirijo group will prosper, because I am a woman. Where in there, however, am I needed? All the dots. Exactly, you should take charge of the company and just be in charge of it. I apologize, it's not something I should be burdening you with. You too work hard as our leader. I was the one who chose you. All the dots. Perhaps I forced the position on you. No, no, I was fine with it. So that you could prove to me that there is no difference between men and... Between men or women. Women. Why did I say woman? That was weird. All the dots. Excuse me, but I'm leaving now. After saying goodbye to Mitsuru, we decided to return to the dorm. Right, on to the next rank then. They were turned ice trip mall, wild duck burger. All the dots. I think I've acquired a taste for fast food. The world is much bigger than I thought, rather than my world was much too small. From my point of view, your world is so brilliant. When I'm with you, I discover so many new things about myself. Laughter, anxiety, it's quite an education. If only it could go on forever. It could! Get on your bike and ride! Mitsuru sounded somewhat sad. Mikoto, when you're with me, what do you think? I enjoyed myself. I see, I'm glad to hear that. Mitsuru is smiling. These days spent with you will no doubt be treasured. I'll keep them near to my heart. You feel a sense of affection from Mitsuru. Rank 7, 3 to go! Level 7, Empress. You decided to return to the dorm. Well, that ended abruptly. On to rank 8. Port Island Station, Movie Theatre. You had a fun time with Mitsuru. I've been wanting to see that movie for a long time. It was very entertaining. Even though it was a typical road trip movie, the way the characters expressed their emotions was great, and there was this one guy who was kept on going like, that's it. I've discovered a new recipe. The main character sacrificed everything just to go on a journey with his friends. All the dots. And then, in the final scene, he decided to return to his normal life. I wonder if he was happy with that decision. Hey Mikoto, have you ever thought about going to a place like that? Somewhere far away, where no one knows who you are? Hmm... I don't know, hmm, what would be best to say here? It's like, I have? Really? I'm surprised to hear that. I didn't know you felt that way. Mitsuru is forcing a smile. Don't misunderstand me, I don't yearn to leave everything behind. It's just that sometimes it's easy to become bound by the things that are important to you. The future of the company, all my responsibilities. Wish I didn't have so much to worry about. Sometimes I feel shackled by my family name. All the dots. However, I know that that kind of thinking is not permitted. See, I've become so undisciplined, constantly complaining. I must bore you with all my griping. Some senpai I am. I've been doing nothing but leaning on you. Mitsuru seems to trust you. Rank 8. Level 8, Empress. I made my decision, and yet all I do is complain. Complain and run from my choice. I talk about responsibility, but in the end, I haven't the courage of my convictions. Was I really this weak? Just a woman waiting for someone to support her? 
I really do find new facets of myself when I'm with you. I am a fool. That's not true. I was probably only fishing to hear that. I am... I'm a shameless... I'm as shameless as I am foolish. Mitsuru is forcing a smile. Yuki. She said Yuki. Would you run away with me? There you are. Mitsuru. I've been looking for you. I didn't expect to find you here. We're leaving. Let's go. All the dots? Question mark? Wait a minute. I didn't make any plans with you for today. Well, my business meeting for this evening was cancelled. I'm a very busy man. You're just going to have to adjust your schedule to mine. No, she hasn't. I can't. I've already made plans. Well, you can break them. I don't think you have anything more important to do than spend time with me. All the dots. I look so sullen. You know this benefits you as well, don't you? I thought you understood our arrangement. Now, you are to be my wife. And you are to be obedient. Oh, I want to punch this guy so much. Uh, why must you and your family always be so difficult? At least your father is no longer alive. I am relieved at that. Oh, smack him. Smack him. I imagine you feel the same. How could you say that? Mitsuru is trembling with anger and furious rage. How dare you? Yuki. Mitsuru seems happy. Who are you? I think you best be quiet. I think you best be quiet, mate. I might punch you. Listen, Mitsuru. Corporate management is not child's play. No matter how smart you are, you're still going to need my knowledge and experience. And the Collegio Group still needs the cooperation of my company, does it not? All the dots. Yes. Good girl, Mitsuru. I knew you'd listen to reason. Now, let's go. I've made reservations for us at l a luxurious restaurant. All the dots. Very well. I wish you hadn't seen that. Well, thank you. I had a lot of fun today. And, sorry. All the dots. Please excuse me. Let's run! Let's run! Stop, Makoto. I know how you feel, I... Mitsuru has a sad look on her face. Let's go, Mitsuru. By the way, who are you? I've never seen you in fashionable society, so I assume you're a commoner. Maybe you do attend the same school, but don't you see the ocean of difference between you and Mitsuru? Because for you too, Mitsuru, choose your acquaintances carefully. After all, they will become mine as well. If your friends aren't suited to high society, I'm the one who'll suffer. That company ruins good morals, as they say. Don't worry, I've picked out other friends for you. What? Refined ones. I advise you never come near me to again, little missy. Punch him. Punch him. Please punch him. I refuse. Do you not grasp the trouble you're causing for Mitsuru? Are you simple? Hmm. You do have a pretty face. It might allow you to sneak your way into high society. Hold on. So that's your scheme. How exciting it must be to use your sex as a weapon. Men, however, require talent. Oh god, I want to punch this guy so much. I have the group to look after. A little girl's burdens are nothing to mine. That's enough. Mitsuri? I said that's enough. Are you getting so angry? If you insult her, you insult me. M Mitsuri? Have you forgotten? If you cross me, then... You spoke of burdens, did you? You were right to do so. Indeed, there's no comparison. She stands on her own feet and fights fate. Oh, I'll say that again so it makes more sense. She stands on her own feet and fights fate with her own strength. Her outlook on life has redeemed and comforted me in innumerable times. She is dear to me. Take back your insults. What? Fine, fine, I suppose you can associate with her from time to time. What a feeble apology. People are not things, they are not pawns, and they are definitely not your servants. A man who fails to understand that cannot possibly develop the group. After all, a company is made of its people. The Kirijo group will not prosper under you. From today forth, you and I are strangers. 
our group shall recover. There is no need to plead for help from a shabby cretin like you. And if you try to do anything malicious, I will use the power of the group to destroy you. Get out of here, you snob. I don't want to see your face ever again. Uh, Mummy, mummy. Oh dear, oh dear. The well-dressed man ran away. A company is made of its people. My father told me that many times. Family, company, society. People are the basis of everything. I think I now fully grasp the meaning behind his words. Let's go home. He decided to return to the dorm. I like that. I really like that. He got his comeuppance, didn't he? Yes. Right. On to the next rank. Gekkakan High School moved up. You sat next to Mitsuru on top of the water tower. You don't need to worry. No one will come. My first abuse of power. You can see miles from here. Sometimes I come here to have a look at the place we're defending. I'm so sorry about what happened the other day. It must have upset you. You were cool. I see. I must say, it's a bit embarrassing to hear you say that. Mr. Roo seems very happy. Thinking back, those words I said to that man stay with me. I must have been seeing people only in terms of interest, according to whether or not they could benefit me. To tell you the truth, it was initially the same with you. Oh, I know, I know. You conveniently arrived and met my criteria to be my my leader. The leader, all right. And the others, the others in C's too were pawns for my purposes. Yukari realized that and snapped at me for it. But I never even tried to understand where she was coming from even though that was exactly it. You opened our eyes and brought us all back together. Nothing is harder than facing every single person straight in the eye. No one could have served better than you as our leader. My judgement was correct. I have quite the eye for people now. Mitsuru seems to trust you. Your relationship with Mitsuru has intensified. Rank 9. Level 9, Empress. I didn't realize I was doing it, but last time I addressed you differently. As Yuki. Oh, I noticed it, I noticed it. It's a bit embarrassing, so I'll address you as that only when we're together. Yuki, you're outwardly adorable. And yet, have it in you to be stronger, more courageous, and more charismatic than charismatic. Yep, charismatic than a man. In the end, it was I who was most hung up on the concept of femininity. Because I am a woman, despite being a woman. It's just a way to excuse myself of failing. Watching you, I realized I had been a coward. From now on, I will no longer allow my sex or my family name to shackle me. I am me. I have things only I can do. And I will accomplish them. I will never ask you to run away with me ever again. Instead, Yuki, stay by my side. Fight alongside me. Live alongside me. Understand? Yep. The hours flew by as you talked with Mitsuru. Dorm, Mitsuru's room. Her room is filled with expensive furniture. I know what you want to say. Our maid staff helped me move here, so that's why it looks like this. That's why you've got red curtains? Alright, fair enough. It's as if there's a second lounge here, isn't it? Uh, oh yeah, the furniture! Of course! Mitsuru is smiling. The hours flew by as you talked with Mitsuru. Oh, I almost forgot. I want you to have this. You received something from Mitsuru. Obtained motorcycle key. Is it mine now? Awesome! It's the key to my motorcycle. I'm not going to run from the future anymore. I don't have to think of my motorcycle as a means to escape my feelings. Though I do regret that I won't be riding it as often anymore. Well, without the key, you won't be riding it at all. Let's ride together, Yuki. But you'll have to sit on the back until you get your license. 
When we're done fighting, I'll teach you how to operate it. I can't wait until then. I'll do my best. Very well. But please be careful. Mitsuru is smiling. I am Mitsuru Kirijo. I hold my head high when I give that name. Thank you, Yuki. You have given me pride. Mitsuru quietly nodded. I felt a tight bond with Mitsuru. Max. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a genuine bond. The innermost power of the Empress Arcana have been set free. There is upon thee the ability to create Ali Lat, the ultimate form of the Empress Arcana. The Mitsuru Kurijo social link has reached its maximum level. You have mastered the Mitsuru Kurijo. Keep saying the names weird. Social link. Your power to create personas of the Empress Arcana has been set through. What has been set free? When I get that from, has reached its maximum. It's because I've been reading the maximum ones for so long now. Yuki Mikoto has forged a bond that cannot be broken. The Emperor's Social Link is at its maximum level. You can now create Ali Lat, the Ancient Goddess. All the dots. Well, back on the subject. Do you have to watch that DVD? Besides, why a horror movie? Fi fine. You don't have to push the package in my face. True Stories, The Cursed House. All the dots. I'm not afraid of what I can't see. But on, on film, the direction and techniques used are another story. Uh, let's watch! All the dots. Would you mind if I held your hand? Oh dear, Mitsuru. You spent a long time together with Mitsuru. Right? And there we go then. Off, off. Indeed. Alright, so that's us done with the social links, and that's us done with Persona 3. I did enjoy it, I did enjoy it. So, next up, World of Final Fantasy. We'll see you probably in that or something else. Bye bye!